yeah. Woo! That's a mare. <laughs> oh, I think I <laughs> scraped the bottom of my truck bed. It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. All right, day two of Space Engineer Scrapyard. Just logging into the server now. Clyde's in the channel with me right now on Discord. <clears throat> You see, you can hear him humming in the background. Um, so yesterday the guys were, after I had logged off, they were busy gathering up components and scrap vehicles and whatnot. So now I feel like I need to pay, play a little catch up. And I got to rebuild my rover and make it much more capable of hauling large amounts of, um, of uh, materials. Hopefully my engineer, yep, yeah, he's still alive, asleep in the bed. Let's see who we got here. Jaxar, Godimus. All right. Let's take a look around the yard, see what's going on. <laughs> Somebody's working on a, a scrap truck. I think Void was working on that. He's going to turn that into a rover himself. This is Jax's starter rover, it looks like. What's this? A trailer? Or a busted ass <laughs> it's a busted ass rover somebody lost their i think that was voids what is this who does this belong to how do i see Oh, this is Voids. <laughs> okay, so Voids rover's damaged. Looks like oh, he's got a battery, but it's yeah, beyond it repair. His um, what's it called? I don't know what he did with it. Uh, he was on for a little bit yesterday and then he logged off and then he might have come back after I left, but he was, when, by the only time I was on, he was on like, what, a half an hour or something. Yeah, he was on while I was watching uh, Jax's stream. Okay. But his, um, uh, what's it called? Yeah, Medical kit? Um, yeah. Yeah, I saw it. Aid station up. or something. It, yeah, it was. It's gone. Mine's gone too. Um, okay, but it should be one laying about somewhere. Yeah, they said that there was an extra <coughs> one. Yeah. So I need to add that to my rover. Mm -hmm. Want tools? Oh, so yesterday when I, I was uh, eating my dinner, <laughs> what happened was That's not what I, I decided I'd go do some casual rovering. And I rolled it, and I lost my uh, my aid station here. Luckily, I didn't kill my battery this time. But let's 
get this thing off from here and we'll share this with my faction. Hmm. Somebody was messing around with my, uh, <laughs> I guess they had to move it or something because my, uh, connectors no longer in my menu or in my G menu. Small connector, here we go. That way I can easily identify it. G menu. Let's show the small connector, switch lock. Oh, there's part. All right, so. Stuff is this over here? Oh, yeah, it's called Survival Kit. I keep calling it an aid station for whatever reason. I'm dumb. I don't know the game. Alright. Anyway. Yeah, I don't see the extra aid station anywhere. Oh, maybe it's up here. Maybe I just missed it. Ugh. Oof. We've got plenty of components. War for battery. Can use that. Would be nice to find some more ice, though. Still haven't found any source of ice. Um, you know what? I think they did find a source of ice. I think Jaxar has it uh, marked on his um, oh, in his GPS. Did. Yeah, I'm not seeing this aid station anywhere. Uh, so I would get it. Or I survival kit, that's right. Yeah, I thought I saw one laying around somewhere. Might be mistaken though. There's some ba some batteries laying around. Uh yes, there will be a bunch of batteries. Am I missing a tool? Hmm. Oh my god. My other tool. <sighs> oh, maybe I'll just salvage one while I'm out and about. I don't need one right now. Find a place to set up my rover where I have access to some components, and we're gonna. I've got a plan to rebuild this sucker. Oh, that's it right there. Oh, I found it. Yeah, there was one, wasn't it? 
Yeah, I thought I saw one over there. So what I'm gonna do is, first need to build a piston, so go ahead and get some steel plates. Lift this guy off the ground. on another airplane. So what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to stick with the base vehicle at its core, but I'm going to move the wheels I'm going to maybe make it into a six wheeler. Move these wheels out that way, these wheels out that way, and add a group of wheels here. And then put like a truck bed in the back for hauling larger items. And put like a high bay here in the front where I can just come and pick heavier items that I want to keep low on my vehicle up with a piston or something. And then maybe put a crane on top. That's the tent of the plan anyway, and I'm going to try to do it in a way where I can expand the build as I need to. And until I absolutely have to have a large grid rover. And then we'll go from there. I'm just going to start cutting this thing down and see where we're at.
I had to bring back complete because I I didn't really have any space to store anything. That is a load. Yes, it is. So you got this set up like a trailer, huh? Mm-hmm. Uh, almost. Does that work pretty well? Yeah, yeah, it does. Um, you need uh, the rotor and the two um, hinges. Otherwise, you'll end up losing traction. So, so it can, like, swivel direction. The problem here is my hinges and the power. Oh, we can use one of these. There, mouse. Maybe one of those. One of what? I'm just saying I could use one of these and one of those. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Yeah, the only thing I'm really interested in, uh, interested in is basically the cargo containers. Uh, Put some programmable blocks in there. on each side, they're not steering, they're not propulsion, they're not braking, no air shock, I'm not sure if that does anything, strength, I guess we'll put that at 100, high offset, it's all zero, let's just make sure they're all zero, friction zero, speed limit, unlimited I guess, propulsion, override, nothing, allow parking brake, no, Power off. I could just see through the friggin' glare. Park over here in the shadow so I can take a look. <laughs> ah, it still doesn't look very good. I still can't freaking see. One thing about this planet, the sun over there, all right. Uh, could use a tune-up as far as it looks, the way it looks, but I think it's functional. All right. It's 
So all we can ask for is that it's functional. All right, now I need to figure out how I'm going to get this uh, survival kit back in place. This is it, right? Make sure we got it at 100% health. Can't see a damn thing. Oop. Come on, come on. Oh, let's get it up there first, I guess. Gotta figure out the controls here. Alright. So, what is the orientation gonna be? Where's the front of the damn thing? How do we spin it? Controls. Alt, I guess. Mm, I'm going to have to go look at the controls for that. You should be able to spin it. What does it say right here? It doesn't say. What buttons? It should be these buttons. I don't understand. It should be the same buttons as it you use to manipulate blocks, right? Take a look at the controls after I take a break. But I think this side here goes into my conveyors like that. So if we can get this right side up. Like that. Make sure it stays healed. Right? And if we can get a merge block, small merge block. Right here and centered. Put another one. Uh, yeah, there. That, except this one needs to come up one. Uh, sucks not having a jetpack. Come on! And it's rubber bandy as hell. Uh, and it doesn't jump when it says jump. There we go. All right. I'm gonna build two of those. I'm gonna grab the components for those. 
Excuse me. I tooted. I farted. I pooted. I pooted. Yeah, I pooped. All right, if we can just get this thing. Let's get up here, I guess. Urgh. Let's go. Double jump. Double jump. <sighs> Let's go. Let's go. It's getting dark again. That sucks. Oh, I can't see a damn thing in the day. I can't see a damn thing at night. All right. So if I can drag this over. I think I might need to build a scaffolding so I can drag it close enough. Right? Come back, come back. Get in place. Yeah, we did it. <laughs> I am a genius. Ugh. All right. Let's cut that shit away. Come on. Now what? Connected here. Let's go take a look at a starter rover. Some Jaxes, Jaxars. Oh, it was a parachute. Okay. Really don't need that, so we'll just leave that free, I guess. Free as a bird now. And I'm going to take a break. I'll be back in a few. And I'm back. And it looks like there's a sandstorm. Now, I was thinking about um, how I'm going to put a cargo container on here. I'm going to put one at first. I think what I want to do is I want to stick it right here. I'll put it above my beacon. I'll leave that in place and then any follow-on cargo containers can come out here along this axis. But in the meantime, I'll just put small conveyors out to a connector that connects out here. And this is how I'll connect to the base for power. I could connect the base from the rear as well, but not uh, as easily well maybe as easily but I want to keep this open so I can't put cargo containers and medium conveyors back here so I'm gonna go through the front of the ship or rover rather so what we're gonna do I guess is we're gonna detach this How do you hit shift? Hmm, I'm not able to detach this. Is it just the angle that I'm on? Let me, let me try on a different block. Detach. So it is control. Maybe it's just the way I was looking at it. Or maybe it was looking at me funny. All right, detach mode. There we go. I just wasn't close enough. And then I can grab it up out of there and set it gently on the ground because we don't want it to explode. 
There we go. And then, what is this? An armor block? Light armor block. And this is a conveyor. And we might even hook this thing up to our cargo tank because we need it in order to pass oxygen and hydrogen. I don't know where I'm going to put the hydrogen tank though. How was I getting it into my cockpit? I only got 77% oxygen right now. It's kind of weird. Um, was it hooked up here at some point? Oh, there isn't a connector there. Man, the server is really elastically rubber bandy right now. How is it hooked up over here? I guess it's not. Huh, weird. Oh, I guess the cockpit's not hooked up. Um, okay. Seriously, bro. Let's go. I swear to God. Let's just do this. ever have to jump again. <laughs> yeah, much better. Much more better. And we'll even do this. Even make a little step here. Might not even finish those blocks. We'll just leave them as they are. So if I don't want to move that, and I do want to make it so that the cargo container is this height so that it can just run straight through these areas. We're just gonna seriously. I need to make the tools reach just one block further than they actually do. I'd be okay with that. Okay, so we'll do uh, conveyors. Conveyor to the these the medium ones, or are these the medium ones? Small, medium. Okay, so let's see that. Let's make that act like a cargo container. Shoot, if we can. All right, so let's put this in there. Six. So that's going to be our stand in for our cargo container, I think. So if it goes like that, and while we're at it, we'll just stick another one of these back here because there was one. And we'll 
do our well might as well make it work right so six Three conveyor. It's gonna basically do one of these doohickeys. That's gonna be perfect. Just the right amount of overhang, I think. always change up the length by putting in one of these things I think or sorter yeah but a uh, yeah that won't work something like that would what do we got here yeah let's try Hmm, I wonder if there's any reason for it to be that way or that way, other than the way it looks. And then we'll put a connector out on the end. Ooh, connectors are long. Well, we'll build it up anyway. See what it looks like. So we got that. That, that, that. And then the cargo container will be back there. At least it's not going to fall off the vehicle if I do it like this. So these are heavier than that. I wonder if they got more integrity. Oh yeah, it's got more integrity. We'll leave it. We'll leave it just like that. These two will be cargo containers most likely. That might be a cargo container as well. Then this will be a cargo container. So let's go see about Oh, oh, I'm going the wrong way. Thought I was driving in reverse. Need some lights. Go ahead and confiscate one of these cargo containers. Hmm, I think I might want the white one because it looks clean. <laughs> I want a nice looking one. Alright. Hmm, what else has he got up here that I might want? Again. What's that? A battery. Ooh. Uh, we got batteries laying around. Oh, another. If I could just move around easily enough. We need one of these. Oops. We are going to need. one of his um, gyros, I think, because this vehicle is so large. So we're going to switch lock on that. Set that over here. Auto locks 
on, isn't it? Turn off. Switch locked. Secure that in the place for him. See, there's a full working battery. Let's get this thing off in there. If I could just get close enough. Ah, clang. Jeez. Thing to be oriented up, I think, or maybe to the side. I don't know. Mm, yeah, to the side, because I'm gonna have. Oh no, maybe I could put the crane right on top of that. Hmm. Decisions, decisions. Let's think about that for a minute. Well, hmm. How do I orient this? Let's check. design decisions you need to make considerations and whatnot okay so yeah it's got one up there so the crank probably hook into that anyway it's more centered in the vehicle it's right there and I want the crane to operate back here mostly anyway so I'm gonna have this to the side I guess we need a well plate. Or, rather, I think it's cheaper to do a merge block, isn't it? Let's see what the well plate costs. Computer and, eh, not that much. But, merge block, on the other hand, merge block costs more. Why the hell? Why aren't we using welding plates more? Well played. Well, in the hail. I guess I can't weld it there. So, okay, I right, well, need construction components. Let's see. GMU weld. Two of those. Let's draw the components. Yeah, let's just put it in the center where the center of the block is going to be on the bottom and then we'll call this also in the bottom oh, come on it's just the wrong height ah there we go just the wrong height or the right height some might say Sir. Hello. Hello. What's going on? Hello. What's going on? 
You're skipping the gym? <laughs> yeah. Terrible. I know, I'm bad. I'm just working on my rover. Yep, I got an hour and a half and uh, logging in to do the same. I hope you don't mind I'm recording right now. So if you oh, don't okay. if you don't care, then that's all good, but um, I could always edit you out because I do intend to put this up on a YouTube channel at some point. Oh shit, yeah, that'd be awesome. No, go for it, dude. Yeah, um, it's just my experience con... playing this game um, on the scenario, so. <laughs> Content advice, like, uh, do we gotta watch my mouth or anything? Oh, hell no. Okay. Good, because <laughs> I'd probably fuck it up just like I don't, that. <laughs> yeah, I don't think, I don't want the channel to be monetized anyway, so it's like, they okay. can't demonetize me unless I do, like, copyright bullshit. <laughs> yeah. So Clyde found some cryopods. That's awesome. Okay, I'm trying to use uh, grabby hands, but I can't rotate the block. How do you do that? I know. I don't know. Oh. <laughs> I, I don't think you can. There's a couple versions of the mod. Uh, we installed the wrong one first. There's one for single player and then one for multiplayer. And yeah. the multiplayer one is incomplete. So it's oh, flagged okay. as being experimental. And it's going to be a little janky. Because the one that I downloaded for my single player world was, um, I guess, the single player one. And I could yeah. rotate the, the blocks. Yeah, that one's finished. Oh, the uh, I've found that left click will stabilize um, if you click and hold, and right click just makes it wig out all over the place. And I think right click is the one that's supposed to let you turn. I need one more um, medium small grid cargo can for the Rust Queen, and that's all the internal storage I think I want for it. Clyde actually brought several. Oh, good. Let's steal one. He's got two more. I'm taking one of them. I'm taking the good looking one. I'm trying to put it on my rover right now. Yeah, we can repaint it later. It's fine. Did, <laughs> did you see what Void did? What he I brought didn't... back? I didn't see. Well, I saw. I see the wreckage of his uh, rover. This red thing over here. This was a almost complete truck, and he really wanted it. And he, on the way back to our little camp here, he flipped over like three times. I think no, maybe four. He flipped yeah. over a yeah. lot. I heard the chatter on uh, on. Uh, Discord, but I, I couldn't see anything because it was a slideshow at that point. Oh, okay. Oh, it's funny. But we eventually made it back. Yeah, want to get. Let me see. Spotlights set up. Light has actually been a huge problem too. Um, out on uh, job sites and stuff like that, just straight up being able to see and having your suit batteries run down. <laughs> and you can set up the vanilla uh, rotatable spotlights to act like a turret, or they they do they are a turret, so you can control them and point them. Oh, that's good. Yeah, so I'm gonna get one on the front and then two on the rear. And the two on the rear will just be set up to follow players around, and the one on the front be controllable.
Yeah, I saw Splitsy's new video actually last night, and he was using a spotlight, and he had it focus on Rex. Focus on Rex. What's that? Or um, on blocks or something. He had oh. a setting so that it would like point things out to him as he drove by. Yeah, that's a good idea. I think I might do that. And we're not using weapon cores, so they'll spotlights will actually work too. I don't know about you, Matt, but I have a, a blast with this. I know that we're just getting started, but it is way more enjoyable than any of the other crap that we've done. Oh, so close. You feeling the same <laughs> or no? Yeah, I'm having fun with it. I'm just really concentrating on getting these web plates to line up. Oh, yeah. Ooh, I got it, finally. <laughs> I now have a medium cargo container. Oh, shit. I could put a second one on here, but I don't want to take up everybody's cargo containers. Everybody needs one, at least. Uh, I actually have two on the rest queen over here, if you need one. So, yeah, go for it. Like, uh, I just pulled one off the, the bed, and I'm going to install it, but there's one extra on the rest queen. Oh, what the heck, I may as well take another one. Yeah. If I find one, I'll haul it back here. Yeah. But this one's so rusty looking. We can build paint guns. <laughs> so you can keep the rust look if you want. I gotta repaint mine. I don't like the gray look. I'm robbing Clyde of all his car cargo containers. Can I get your help over here, actually, if you got a sec? Yep, just let me uh, unlock this real quick. Drag it over to my yeah. rover. off in here. I can't unlock this thing. Vision auto lock. Switch lock. Energy low. Oh shoot, I think this one has stuff in it because it's so heavy. Oh, yeah. Yeah, okay, I'm coming. I'll empty it out in a minute. All right, what are you trying to do? I just need a hand getting this lined up. It's turned sideways right now. So if you uh, grab hold of the... We can probably do it from the ground. If you grab hold of the corner over here, and I'll grab hold of the other corner, and we'll see if we can spin it. You got it? Oh, yep, yeah, you got it. Step back a little bit and see if that... Yeah, there we go. Oh. Okay, release, release. Oh, I thought I released it, sorry. Oops. <laughs> Let me get a hold I of it. I hit left click instead of R. You lift it up. It's not going up high enough. There we go. Okay, let's release one more time and get it steadied. You gotta say when. <laughs> okay, you release. <laughs> Let me just get it up there. Maybe getting it up there is a one-person job. Getting it aligned is a two-person job. Okay, I'm gonna grab hold of this corner again. 
you get the other one. We'll kind of spin it around. Here, I'm going to release and grab the other corner real quick. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. No, no. <laughs> you <laughs> piece of shit. You know what? Let me go get up on top. This might be easier with one of us on the roof. If I can get it up top. I took the ladder off the back so I can get up here. Oh shit, you almost have it. Is that the orientation you want? Yeah. Just gotta gently nudge it. Hey, look at that, master engineer. <laughs> nice job. I had practice over here. <laughs> uh <laughs> trying, to, trying to offload the, and then weld it to my own. No big deal. I've been doing this for years. the heck come on let's go oh streaming ah <laughs> come on energy let me select my tool critical. oh shoot i'm almost out of energy gotta recharge my batteries oh i can't wait to get back out on the road and salvaging some shit Oh, the uh, pistons over here just freaked out a little, for a little bit. All right, we need to remove this thing. Yeah, something going on with the, uh, oh shoot, uh oh. I think something's going on with the server. Everything's a little laggy yeah i'm feeling it too i almost deconstructed my entire cargo container over here Ooh. have been terrible. Weld. Oops, that's not what I meant to do. That right there. And then. Yes, we got everything we need. Have you happened to find any better tools out there in the wild that you could part with? Uh. Yeah, and then Void stole Jax's, Jax died, and I gave mine to Jax's, uh, to okay. Jax. Because <laughs> that's one of the things I need to do. I need to go find some lockers. Yeah. 
<laughs> I had a whole set of at least here, uh, well, the, the, the next level up. And then the I had up, a yeah. welder that had at least two chevrons, I think. But then I died. Oh, shit. That sucks. They're on the other side of the planet. Does my body despawn, or will it still be there if I if I happen to find myself on the, that side of the planet? A uh, cleanup is off, so it shouldn't despawn. Ugh, come on. I think I need to do this. Oh, I need to get some plates. Yeah, it was one of the things Splitsy was very clear on. Cleanup needs to be off for this mod to work properly. Okay. And I'm sure we're eventually going to have to do something to clean up all just the random steel plates and shit like that we've got laying around everywhere. But so far the server seems fine. Might have to have like a cleanup day where you go and say everything you want to keep, make it safe, and then just go and like manually clean it all up. Yeah. Do we have. Did Clyde bring back any large, small grid batteries over here? Do you know? Yep. Oh, he did, yeah. Look at all the shit he's got just fucking stapled together. Ugh, Clyde! <laughs> yeah, I know. It's, it's just a rat's nest. I tried to get a, uh, uh, a, uh what is it? <laughs> a thingy dingy. <laughs> um, a gyro off in there, and I, I broke free a bunch of other stuff that came with it. Experiencing the same right now. But you know what? That's fine. Oh, look at you. Yours is getting big. Is there anything left of the uh, base rover, or is it all gone? All the green stuff. <laughs> the battery and the the cockpit. And then I added an, uh, my destroyed, uh, what's it called, survival kit. I found... The nice. one that was in the yard here. This uh, cargo container is like... Oh no, it's not. I thought it was clipping through these unfinished blocks, but it's just having a bitch of a time trying to get around into the space that I've allotted for it. Yours. You got, got it. it. <laughs> and it's in the orientation that I intended. Nice. Let's see, cargo, I mean, conveyor. Fuel and conveyor. That's the one, I think. 
Oh, I need interior plate. Yes, I think it is. Yeah, it is. We got two small, small grid hydrogen thrusters now. That's awesome. I guess these are all the lights. Stick these on the side here, like. Like so. They're good for seeing where I'm going. Ah, stupid conveyor sorter there. It's inconvenient. I'll have to put a a junction there instead eventually. So that's good, and then I think we need some undercarriage lights, like under here. Yeah, so some panel lighting. Uh, yeah, one right, come on, one right there might be good, one back here might be good. Off center is fine. That's mostly so we can see the ground. If we uh, gain some air, I can see how far off the ground I am. We might change the color of those to be maybe orange or something that's a little less intense. And then, of course, we need tail lights. Uh, we're going to stick these. I like these ones, these are cool. Uh, we need construction components. <clears throat> oh. Keep wanting to go grab from in front of that sorter. I knew I'd regret putting that sorter in there. I don't even know why I would use it right now. We can make those red. And ooh, you know what I think I want to do? If I can build these. Ooh. Godimus looks like he disconnected instead of logged off. He's probably gonna die right there. <laughs> anyway, um if I can build these, what are they called? I might want to put a couple of those on my vehicle. Exhaust pipe. Yes, you can build those. It doesn't cost very much either. Put a couple of those to cover up the ends of, or the back ends of my, uh, my pistons. Here and here. I'll provide a little bit of light too. To get those to work. I guess there's a setting that you can do. Well, anyway. Um, and then in the back, or on the sides here, I guess we want where are the angled lights? I don't think we have any angled lights, do we? I guess we'll replace this block here. Or actually, hmm. Let's leave that the way it is. We'll, 
cover up this area right here with a light. We'll do the same on the other side. Ooh, that's a different color, isn't it? Can't have that now. What color was that? The darker blue? Let's stick that on there, and then we'll stick this down here. There we go. And then maybe we'll change the look of it later on, make it blend into the body a little bit better. And what else do we need? I think that's good. We'll just change the color up. So we'll make, let's go to the K menu. These ones, these ones, those ones and those ones, we'll make them like an orange color. How do we get orange here? Like, like that? Mostly red. Ooh. Give it a 10 meter radius. Oops. I didn't mean to take a screenshot, but there it is. And then fall off uh, intensity, maybe a little less intense than it initially comes. And then we'll do the tail lights. Those will be just red. Uh, maybe a uh, like a, a dull red. And then radius. Hmm. I guess that's a good radius. Fall off. Offset. Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. Minimize the offset. Uh, and uh, let's say these ones, the offset, we might want to adjust. Where's the offset? like that and that way it illuminates out to the side pretty well okay and then we have oh mag plates we wanna definitely don't use those for parking um, and then let's see lights these two spotlights Make it a nice, cool color. Like a bluish hue. And radius, intensity, hmm. offset. Okay. I don't know if I want one to light up my bed. I think we might want a light back here. Like a Let's put, I guess, we'll do two of these. And 
lights, corner light, radius a little bit bigger, fall off, maybe like that, intensity, default, offset, yeah, right there. Oh, perfect, perfect, perfect. And then maybe the color will be like a cool color, like a weird bluish, purplish color. There, that's perfect. Or at least it looks pretty good. Let's go rovering. I want to go get some uh, salvage. And then we'll set up my crane as a... Uh, I think that's all we need to do. I'll set up my crane as we need it. See, we got about four hours of battery. I'm gonna have to find some power cells to get this second battery up and running. Looks like my speed's pretty good. Am I gonna be able to find my way back to base? Whoa, slamming on the brakes. Okay, that is a GPS location, a windmill. So this one's garbage. We'll get rid of that one. How do I delete it? Oh, right there. Batteries. Ooh, yeah, let's go for those batteries. Large Atmo Flux Thruster. We already got that. Mr. Shotgun 1. We don't need that anymore. This stuff is on the other side of the planet, but we'll keep it. Okay, so batteries. Let's go after those batteries. If no one else has gotten it already. We're on an adventure! Let's see how this thing performs at my top speed, which I set at 100, I think. Oh, yeah. On these dunes, that's perfect. I don't think I'm going to lose control of it. Getting a little bit of air. I can see what I'm doing. I can see the, the ground underneath me. If I get too much air, I'll, those lights will get dimmer or smaller like this. We'll see it in a minute. Maybe uh, I'll get some air on this one. Oh yeah! Woo! That's some air! <laughs> oh, I think I <laughs> scraped the bottom of my truck bed. I can steer a little bit with my, my gyros. this over here my spotlight gonna shine on it hello spotlight wake up and it's not working looks like someone might have already junked this well, anyway uh, let's see if I can get my spotlight to work not shine my headlights on it. Spotlight. Oop, that's not right. Searchlight, that's it.
rockets. Oh, it's targeting me, isn't it? Don't target characters. I think that's what it's doing. Oh, maybe not. It should be targeting this stuff. Or maybe it's targeting my rover. So... Searchlight. Target turns off. Target neutrals. Target enemies. And enable idle movement. Huh. I wonder how we got that set up to work like that. I don't know why it's not working. Damaged? Hello? Wake up! Wake up, dude! What are you doing? Let's go to 500 meters. Target me. Oh, is he? He's targeting me, I think. Oh, he's giving me light. That's actually pretty cool. Okay, it's working. Alright, are you going to target these uh, grids over here or what? I think he's still targeting me. Search S E A R C H. Target friends off. Target enemies on. Let's go check this out. Maybe we'll start working in a minute. I'll have to look up later how to get it to work appropriately. Looks like somebody already rat fucked this place. See if they left anything behind. What is that? Ears. Hydrogen tank. What's this down here? Oh, a light armor block. Let's just take this with me. Why not? Jump when I tell you to jump, asshole. <laughs> Alright, this will be good practice. So, magnetic plate. 
Let's change the color of these. Maybe these will be red. Just stick this one over here to the side. And we'll go lift it up. I can just keep it flat. There we go. It's stuck. All right, now it's locked. Use for parking? No. Good, good, good. All right. Good job. Let's go after those batteries. Oh, they're off that way. Battery time! Battery time! Let's do it. Let's run this shit over. Oh, I missed it. We'll get the next one. Let's go get these batteries. Maybe they'll have some power cells in them. I'll just salvage them. Oh, ooh, that saw some sparks. Maybe we shouldn't go so fast. <laughs> I wonder where my center of mass is right now. It's probably towards the front. Let's see if anybody's got this already. Doesn't look like it. Mmm, I wonder if maybe I should try to haul this whole thing back. Ooh, we've got power cells in these. All kinds of power cells. Let's, let's get these ones. These ones. Maybe we'll save one of them. See if we can rebuild our battery yet. Oh, oh, wait a minute. Oh, it destroys power cells, doesn't it? Oh, that's where the scrap metal is coming from. God damn it. Okay. Lesson learned. I guess I can't pick this up. Okay, righto. Hmm. Yep. I can't do anything with them. We just have to cut them free. I guess I have to find power cells in containers. I guess that's the idea. We gotta find them separately. Let it go. <laughs> it's acting funny. All right. Come on, tip over, jackass. And we'll get these off in there.
Okay, so power cells, eh? This one has some power cells in them now, in it now. So we'll go magnetic plate, right? This one right here. We'll stick this one right here. There we go. We got a battery. Uh, let's see what else we got. We might have. We can out. Alright. Maybe that'll be better. See if there's anything in these seats. the other side so I can get components and shit. Easy enough. The logistics of this whole thing, I'm just trying to figure it out. Just trying to figure it out. Figure her out. So we need to draw some components. Hmm. We need computers. Credits. Clan Cola. And cola. I wonder if that's worth anything. Three. <sighs> Hack it. I mean, kill it or whatever. Okay, we need detector components. I want to get that out of there. I don't know how we're going to get those. We'll just cut it free. Let's see if we can unveil any other items. Yeah. Yeah. So hydrogen tank. Oop. 
Wrong way. Sun's coming up. She's gonna blow. I don't want him to blow on me. Alright, so I guess we'll take this. Uh, let's see what else. Anything else of value in here? Nah, nada. Zero zilch. Alright. So let's just dump off a bunch of my stuff. All right, here we go. We are going for it. Oh yeah, these uh, exhaust pipes. Let's see if we can get those set up. Exhaust pipes. Let's just put it at one percent. How come they're not working like, uh, Economists are. Ooh, that's right. I forgot. I forgot to batten down the hatches. <laughs> I have to ask Economist when uh, he gets back on. He can tell me how he got the flames on his exhaust pipes. Oh, what was this? Steel plate? for parking we learned that lesson early early on we do not want to use for parking thank you Ooh. there we go let's uh, switch lock get it to stop clanging It says it's locked. Here we go. All right, let's go find a signal. We're scrapping now, boys. <laughs> I can't see my compass bearing because of the friggin' washed out uh, sky effects. Look at that. We can turn the lights off now, I guess. Saves the power. Woo! Ugh. Bam. Perfect. All right. Let's skirt the edge of these uh, mountains and let's stay in the desert. Because the desert is where I roam. Oh. 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 No! Shit. Okay. <laughs> There goes my crane. Oh! And I lost my battery! God fucking damn it. <laughs> oh, shit. Well, looks like I'm walking from here. <laughs> <laughs> 